Hi everyone, today I have for you the Allure Beauty Box and truth be told, I thought this was the one for November and actually it is the one from October. I just apparently have been holding on to it for too long. Um, I thought it was November's and it came early and I was waiting for the Ipsy one to come in. I was gonna do them together um, and then I realized that it was actually not, it was October's and I never did that one. So uh, two changes right off the bat from October. First of all, the way the box looks, it looks like this. This is a printed on Allure. Um, which is okay. I, I don't mind it. I liked the looks of the last box a little bit better. And also when you open it up, it opens like this. Okay. Um, and there's no tissue paper inside or anything like that. Um, and the last month's box, here's a sample of it right here. It's a nice thicker box, I think. Well, maybe it's not really thicker. It just feels that way because it's coated and that's a nice um, metallic shine on there. Um, and then when you open it up, there was nice tissue paper and that's where they put everything. So I did like the looks of the last box, but I'm sure it was a, I don't know if it was a financial or save the earth kind of thing. So that's okay. I'm all right with it. Um, anyway, uh, the other change to Allure's box is that the price went up and that was a surprise to me. Um, I believe they did send an email out and I probably just um, discarded it by accident but okay. Um, it used to be $15 a month and I thought that was a really good value. It was a little bit more than Ipsy, but it was, I find the products to be better. Um, but now it's gone up from $15 to 23 and I feel like that's a big leap. Um, I think the extra $8 a month is kind of a lot, quite honestly. Um, however, they do, I guess now they say from what I read is that it's um, an extra, it's at least six items and there'll be three full size items, which in the previous boxes, I believe they gave you maybe two full size items. Um, so it's a, it's a little bit more. The only issue that I'm having with it is that at the $23 price point, there are other boxes out there. Sorry, I'm shaking the camera. There are other boxes out there that are $25 and they give all full-size products. So it's like five or six full-size products, depending on what box you get. So I was kind of toying with the idea of maybe changing, but I'm going to give it a couple of months. Um, I know I say that a lot, but I'm going to give it a couple months and see, um, because I tend to really like the products that come inside Allure um, a little bit better. So... I don't know, that's just me, but let's see what's inside this month's box. Okay, so of course the first thing that they have is this, it's the little booklet that tells you about all the products and the uh, retail price of the full size product. Um, all right, so inside, the first thing I'm seeing is Tropical Sea. I believe this is probably like a serum. Uh, let's just see inside real quick. Oh yeah. I wonder if this is full size. It's pretty big, huh? Vitamin C uh, seems to be the new thing as far as skincare. It's a it's a very popular uh, product. The next is I don't know how to say this. I'm gonna butcher it. Ceramidin, ceramidin cream, and apply to a fire entire face to maintain maintain healthy hydrated skin. All right, so it's not like just a you know, a spot cream. It's like for your whole face. So that's okay. I need those. I like to try new ones. Uh, the next is La Roche-Posay Lip Car Balm. Intense Repair Moisturizing Cream. Oh, that was not at all focused. And that's what it looks like inside. Okay, next we have Verso Super Eye Serum with Retinol 8. And that looks like it's a full size actually, probably because it's eye serum, so I'm sure. I, I could be wrong. Wouldn't be the first time. But that's a really good size bottle. 0.67 fluid ounces. Uh, next we have a nail polish, which is obviously a full size. This is this is not showing up on camera the same color it is in person. It's a little bit darker than it looks. Um, just a little bit. It's kind of a pretty, you know, nude kind of shade. So that's kind of nice. I like that. Uh, this one is Sigma Liquid Lipstick. And the shade is Venom. Well. Ooh. And this is what it looks like. I feel like that's 
really gonna be bright. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, it's actually, it's a darker color but it's actually a really pretty color. It's much better than what I have on my lips right now. That's nice. Oh, I like that. Okay, and then the last, oh, I'm lying, it's not the last thing, but I thought it was the last thing. Uh, Native Fig Replenishing Shampoo and Conditioner. You know, I'm gonna tell you, I'm really happy this is in here. Not because I've ever heard of it, because I haven't, but I'm always looking for a new shampoo and conditioner. I want to find one that I really love and I haven't quite done that yet. So if anybody has any tips on a really good shampoo and conditioner, I would appreciate it. Um, and then there's another thing in here. This, so this is the last thing. This is hydrating collagen eye pads from Wilma Schumann European Skin Care. So that's a nice sample of that. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven items. Eight. Oh my goodness. One, two, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight, not seven. So that's good. Increase in price, increase in products. I don't know. I'm not disappointed. I'm disappointed the price went up, but I'm not disappointed in the products. So I don't know. We'll see. I am happy with this box, even though it was an increase in price, but um, it was a lot of products. Eight products is kind of a lot. So I'm okay with it. The other thing with Allure that I really like is they kind of give you a variety. It's not like just all makeup or, you know, all skincare. So I like, I really like that part of it. Okay. So that was for October and I should be getting November's any day now. So I'll probably be doing that soon. All right. I hope everybody has a great day.